It is a weather alert day. Why? Because rain and storms will actually pop up throughout the day. Isolated severe storms possible. Lightning a threat with any thunderstorm. A primary threat here. The primary severe threat will be the possibility of strong wind. So we hit 89 today. Hot and humid. It's going to feel more like it's in the mid 90s throughout the area. So definitely feeling the heat. So here it is. The areas under the slight risk means that you could see isolated severe storms. So Muncie, Indianapolis, Peru, Lafayette, Crawfordsville, all under that risk today. I think the western portion of the state under a greater risk because of as these storms slide in, they're going to slide in west to east and I think weakening for many locations as they slide east. So temperatures at 73 for Indianapolis, 72 for Bloomington, 67 for Peru. So 60s and 70s throughout the area. Let's jump right in here and take you through Truecast. So Truecast showing this morning pretty quiet as expected. 630 no rain, 830 no rain, quiet, just awaiting those scattered showers to the west to arrive in our area. By about 10 o'clock, I think you'll notice the increase in humidity and the increase in cloud cover. And by about noon, isolated storms lining up on the western portion of the state, first moving in to Lafayette and to Crawfordsville. So I do think the western portion of the state will get in on some isolated storms. Right around 2, 3 p.m., we start to see some spotty showers and storms pop up throughout the area. And as this system slides through, yes, the potential of severe weather is with us throughout the day. But I think the greatest risk of severe storms happens tonight as the front passes. We'll get to tonight's forecast in just a second. Let's talk about those high temperatures near 90 degrees for you. If you're in the south of Bloomington to Columbus and about 89 for Indianapolis, I skipped to the seven day planning forecast because I want to plan out your day here and show you that. Yeah, there's a chance of storms in the forecast every day going forward here. And as we plan out today, you'll notice that we have a mild start to the day. Uh, isolated storms possible throughout the afternoon hours and that severe threat with us later this afternoon to the evening hours. Temperatures hit about 89 at around 4 to 5 p.m. Let's go uh, back to the numbers here and take you a look through look through Truecast. This is 6 p.m. tonight. We pick the forecast back up as the front slides in more numerous showers and thunderstorms with us overnight tonight is when I think we get in on the heaviest rain. Uh, of course, these thunderstorms slide through pretty quickly and most of us are sleeping. So make sure you have that storm shield app handy so you can hear any watches and warnings that may be issued with the system. Thursday morning, I think we'll start out with some rain, but I don't think Thursday is a rainy day all day. Temperatures are slightly cooler as the front passes only at 86 degrees. I do think we'll start out in the 70s on Thursday, not as warm through the afternoon and really not as muggy on Thursday. And we'll continue that trend as we head into the weekend. I know lots of things happening this weekend. The Indiana Black Expo free concert on Friday night. There is a 20% chance of a spot shower there. We're going to keep you dry at the convention center there on Saturday and on Sunday, just a 20% chance of a spot shower. So yes, they're with us, the chance of showers, but it's not very impressive this weekend today. Yes, definitely dealing with a 40 to 50% chance of rain with those isolated showers and storms that could become severe this afternoon.